Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to get into this Lewis lace closure wig that I am wearing right now. Of course, QB Wig Collections. I have custom made this wig for myself. HD lace, of course, and we are going to go a little bit into the HD lace. Okay, you guys, super thin, glueless, blends in with my skin, ready to go. I am in love with this wig. I'm gonna go ahead and show you what the little wig looks like before. I'm gonna go ahead and style her, put her on really quick. She's glueless, so so easy to throw on and just get out the door, okay? So, stay tuned. <laughs> Let me just talk through some of this really quickly. I just blow dried this raw Indian hair. I used two 18 inch bundles, maybe about 75% of the 16 inch bundle. And then I have an 18 inch closure, which I didn't need, but I just used it anyway. <laughs> so I just blow dried the hair as smooth as I can, not really as smooth as I can get it, but I just blow dried it out straight. And now I am just putting the curls in. I'm not gonna flat iron the hair first because I want the hair to be like a textured, a little bit textured of a curl. I don't want it to be like super sleek or anything like that. The curling iron gives me a little bit more sleekness anyway. So I am just gonna throw some big curls in her and then I'll go ahead and put her on and you guys can see the HD lace on her. I have a HD lace closure. I didn't need a frontal necessarily for this look because around the face I wanted the hair to be very thick and I wasn't planning on doing a side part or anything like this, anything like that with this look because of the way I want the hair to fall in the front, which you guys will see once I put the wig on. I don't want it to fall a certain way. So let me just finish these big curls really fast because I have a client coming <laughs> as usual. And then I will go ahead and put her on. All right, I made it to the top of the wig doing some really big curls. I'm trying to debate if I want some volume with this hair, some height where my closure is or not, but I'll work it out once I put the wig on, see what I want, how I want it. It's not the way I need it to be curled. There we go. Right. So I'm going to finish this up and then we can get into putting the lace down. I'm not going to put any glue. I'm just going to tint the lace, my skin tone, and then we should be good. Okay, so I haven't combed anything out yet. Sorry guys, let me really sit in this chair. Okay, so I haven't combed anything out yet and I just put her on my head. As you can see, I haven't cut the lace or anything on her. This lace is really fragile, okay? I will get as close as I can with my camera so you guys can see. HD lace is not to be played with, you guys, okay? Oh my gosh, so sensitive, so thin. If you are one to really put holes in your lace, if you are one to like snatch your wigs on and off, you really don't take care of them that well, HD lace is not for you, not at all. If you take care of your wigs, you make them last long, all of that, then you might be able to get by with HD lace. Oh my God, it is like super hella foggy outside right now. I can't even see my car in the parking lot. Fire trucks going down the street. I see those lights. Ooh, y'all, it's crazy. Freezing cold outside today. But anyways, back, <laughs> back to the wig. So I used the lace closure. I am going to style my hair how I want the style to be. I'm, I have it in my head how I kind of want the style to be. I use a medium cap for my wig. Of course, everybody's head size is different. So I'm going to cut this lace off. Let me get my scissors. I'm going to get as close as I can. Try to do it in the camera so then you guys can see. Let me grab the clip. There we go. All right. Bring this camera up. There we go. So this is the HD lace. All right, so now let me try to cut as close as possible. Looking in the camera. Oh my God, it's literally just kind of pulling off. Hold on, y'all. 
I can't really see, so I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna have to look in my other mirror low key. Ooh, I'm gonna have to look in my other mirror a little bit because I can't really see. And the lace literally up against these scissors, it's just coming right off. Right, right off. Let me move this so I can do this side. Get this on. Ah, there we go. So this is a little piece of HD lace I took off. It's off my head. You could see it. Pull her up, put her down. All right, now I'm gonna style her. So when ordering online, HD lace is for sure hard to come by, you guys, okay? So I'm gonna try to keep it as in stock as I can. Transparent lace, I've been trying to keep in stock as well. Let me comb these out. I don't want it to be, I just kind of want my hair to be crazy, not so uniform curls, so. I like big hair, so I don't care about separating my curls and making my hair big. All right, now let me get the curling iron so I can get my front together. Two hours later. Oh my God. All right, so this is the wig. You guys won't believe what I just did. I just recorded so much and the camera wasn't even recording <sighs> let me get my life together but this is the wig i've already done like everything i cut the lace and i was talking about the hd lace and everything and i feel so bad that it's just gone but anyways this is the hd lace that i have on my head and i have a middle part i don't plan on parting her in any other direction but this is kind of how I want my hair to be. It's a glueless wig, of course. So I can take her on and off every night if I feel like it. Or if I don't feel like it, of course, you guys know you can sew your wigs on and all of that. So definitely doesn't have to be, you know, glueless. If you want glue, you can add glue if you want. That's why I chose a five by five lace closure because I wanted my part to be in a certain place and I knew I wanted like bangs really cut into my wig. So definitely it's up to you, you guys. If you guys want to order a wig like mine or like another wig that you want custom ordered, I have a custom order wig form on my website. And of course you guys can email me and contact me at any time. I will definitely guys definitely hit you guys back okay so I feel like I look like my mama almost in this wig but with a middle part my mom don't never do a middle part but oh my god it's so freaking foggy outside I can't even see my car okay I, it's foggy as hell outside anyways so HD lace is super thin you guys you guys gotta be careful with the HD lace if you can't handle the HD lace if it's too thin it rips very easily but it lays super flat and it blend it blends super well super well you guys if you can't handle it get transparent lace it's a little bit thicker you can tint it whatever color you need to tint it and it'll last you a little bit longer because it's 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 a little bit thicker that's really what it is but if you want that flawless look that QB swag let me tell you, go ahead and get you that HD lace. Don't be mad if you rip it. I'd rather you be mad that it's going to be laid for the gods, literally. So this is my hair, what it looks like. I put just a few layers in the front. And I did use a bundle of 18 for this wig, which goes down to here, but I curled it kind of tight. And I kind of trimmed it a little bit. So, I mean... It's like a 16, 18 inch wig, really, is what it is. Cause I kind of trimmed the ends cause I want my ends to look fairly thick. So I kind of trimmed it just a little bit. And that was it. This is it. I'm about to be wearing this wig for a while. It's 2023, happy new year. Try a new style. I did color this hair jet black because I've been saying I want jet black hair probably for about two months now. So I did end up coloring this hair jet black. This is the raw Indian wavy. And that's pretty much it y'all. I'm super excited to have this wig on. Oh my God, I've been waiting for so long. Woo! 
So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you guys in the next one. I appreciate your support. Don't forget to comment, subscribe if you like more videos like this. Check out my other videos on my page where I go through different hair types, different hair textures, all of the above at QB Wig Collections. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.